What you guys is doing? Monkey Pop Pig. And we had to keep him up with George, the publisher of Keep Him Up. How is that? It's good. It's fun. It's always exciting. There's always something new and something different. And, uh, and this year for San Diego Comic Con, we've got like some of the best exclusives. We've been lines all day, every day for people buying a lot of the cool stuff that, that we're showcasing. So you're pretty busy. Yeah. Yeah. Busy. Yes. Okay. So can you tell me a story behind Kid Robot? So a story kind of behind Kid Robot is. The exact history? No, not exactly. <laughs> <laughs> well, well I, Kid Robot has always wanted to focus on exclusives and, and more of a specific a kind of an artist thing that something you can really want to showcase in your, in your oh, home. Yeah. You know, like like starting to get more high end Art Deco pieces. Like like this is our first bus that we've done. Uh, partnering with the Andy Warhol Foundation, yeah. uh, and so these are beautiful. And these are like the lavender uh, edition here is exclusive uh, for San Diego Comic Con. We also have some of the other sculptures that we're doing. So Kid Robot wants to focus on, on the fan and the director with things like you know Simpsons, South Park, uh, Hello Kitty, Bob but they could be Bob's Burgers. But we also want to go into more art pieces, you know, like Parking with the Met and some of the beautiful dummies that, that we've got here. Oh, I love them. Yeah, they're really, really, they're really nice. Uh, and then working with artists like Polis, who do these, do these gorgeous uh, jumper figures. He also designed our Bambi Thumper, okay. uh, which I'll show you uh, after this. But uh, yeah, that's kind of the, the, the story of the robot. Is that they really want to cater to the casual fan as well as like the, the more hardcore art collector uh, with uh, some really nice high-end pieces. Yeah, good story. He robot and kind of set the temple apart. I think so. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, 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 yeah I do too. That's one thing I appreciate that they had the good. Uh, and they, you know what? We're going to do our own thing. Exactly. Yeah. It, it works out so well. Yeah, so are you, let me ask you a question. Yeah, okay. Are you more of a casual? Collector, or do you enjoy more of the high-end? Oh, Let's put you on the spot. Oh, <laughs> I would say a little bit of both. Okay. Like, I love the today, but I also love the display. Yeah. I like pieces that people are like, what did you get that? What is that? Yeah. It's yep. unique. Yeah. You gotta get a cookie cut out of what I do with that. Yeah. Exactly. That's behind you. Yeah. And I think with a lot of these pieces, when people come over and they see them, mm -hmm. it's a conversation starter. Oh, They're gonna yeah. ask where you got it, you know, what's the story behind it. So. Mm -hmm. I think the world, like, I was a bit out there. Sure. But that is very good. Yeah, it is. Yeah. The only Andy yeah. Warhol stuff is really beautiful. I even like the, the Asian right wing, this, this dunny that they have. Oh, so yeah. so and if, if you look inside the box here, there's kind of a nice, almost hologramish kind of thing going on. Take care of you guys. That's a beautiful piece. Yeah, it is. It really piece. is. Yeah, we've also uh, we've partnered with Sergio Mancini as well as as well as Kix. Oh, I always mispronounce his name. I hope it's Kix. And uh, with our six six inch uh, art figure here, which is a Comic Con exclusive as well, and that's a beautiful beautiful piece. Is it great? Um, and then, of course, Hello Kitty is always a huge seller. Oh, yeah. Always. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Not mine, but I know so many of our fans love Hello Kitty. Yeah. In decades. In uh, it's huge. Yeah. And you remove it for about probably 10 years. And you got to tell me. Yeah. The people who love the Hello Kitty. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. You are right, Hello I'm not going to confirm or deny. He did. He did. He did. If you wanted to. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, hey, I have a couple of tips. Okay. So, right. we're in the same thing. Okay, good. Yo, <laughs> okay. so, I appreciate your time. Sure. And you're easy. You want to keep people in the world.
Yes, uh, I did want them to know that uh, the artist uh, Colas who designed uh, this beautiful jumper here, as well as our Bambi and Thumper figures that we're doing pre-orders for, he's going to be doing a signing here on Saturday. And for anybody that pre-orders the Bambi and Thumper, they'll get an exclusive lithograph that he'll sign. Really? Uh, yeah, and if you wow. want to come over here, I'll show you the, yeah, show the me Bambi that. and Thumper. Go ahead. The white. And these oh. are the, these are right. That is beautiful. beautiful. Yeah. That's awesome. So this is the black and white. I there. like the black and white. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. Yeah. So this is this number and then our Bambi, and these are the. Uh, true life sizes for, for them. They're beautiful pieces. Yeah. Great sizes. Yeah, too. they really are. So is this on the website? So this, uh, you, yes, you can pre-order on the website. And you will say, oh, at the booth, right here, to eat your coverage. Yep. I appreciate your time. You're welcome. Yeah. yeah. It was fun. Have a good one. Thank you, you too. Everybody. Thank mm -hmm. you.